What's up guys? Welcome back to more Spooktober stuff. I was on itch looking around and this game popped up. It looked pretty cool. It seems like it's pretty simple. The controls, and that's weird, I ended up stabbing my finger at work and now like my little this finger I can't feel the end of it so typing is a little weird. Um, so if I mess up some stuff just just ignore that. <laughs> it might take a little bit to go back to feeling it again and then I can actually move around exactly. But anyways, all this is, looks like all the controls. You hold the or left mouse button to pick something up, hold the right to use it. I guess you have to continue holding it or else you'll drop it. You can escape, pause the game, and that's pretty much the end of it. So I'm sure this is going to be based entirely on atmosphere as far as the horror mechanic of it. Because it doesn't seem like there's any real interaction way other than just moving stuff around. But we're going to try this out and see how well this goes. It looks really cool. Basically, you're like, either you're hunting witches or you are being hunted by a witch. I know there's witches and there's hunting. I don't know exactly which order of which that combines into. So that part's a mystery to me. But it looks cool and uh, I'm starting to get my voice back as well. So just everything's starting to go pretty good. So let's go ahead and get into this to see what all it's got for us. This should be pretty interesting. Here we go. Oh, wow. It just immediately wakes us up and here we go. You can, oh, now the mouse is gone. I was like, you're not gonna record all that, are you? Okay, well, here we are, and uh, I have to say, first off, the game looks pretty good for being a really early indie game, but let's see what this is. What are you? Oh, you can pick it up, and it flops all around. It just a flops about, oh shit, get that windmill going, baby, Jesus Christ. If I was hot, I'm not anymore, that's a good fan, and then you hold, oh shit, oh, how does this work? Damn it, okay. Oh, oh, okay. Does that do it? If I let go, does it just drop it? Yep, it does. Okay, pick that up. Press the button. Don't hold it. Press it. 14th day of August. The Duke of Tarnstead is due in three days, but Isabel will have nothing to do with the marriage. The Baron needs to rule his daughter as he rules his lands. And all my... It, if my daughter was sniffing around an accused witch, I'd be taking my belt to her. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, this was back in the witch times, so people were pretty crazy. Bear that in mind. The Baron should learn to heed his advisor's warnings. I've never led him astray. Okay, uh, it does not appear that I can read any more than once on the page, which is cool, because that means we don't have to read unnecessary crap. Uh, there is no sprint or anything. It doesn't appear that there's any kind of light source or any of that, so this, this is what it is. Let's see. And immediately we can go left or we can go right. Hmm. Well, looks like there's something on the table. Let's check this out you got for me. Oh, it's another book. All right, pick it up. Windmill. Windmill! Yes. Oh, shit. Reverse windmill! Oh, can we do it in slow motion? Oh, almost. Kind of. Sorry. All right. Let me quit being retarded. All right. 17th day of August. I've tried to warn him, but now it's too late. The Baron is dead, cursed with a vile affliction. His flesh nearly boiled from his bones. Jesus Christ, that sounds freaking horrible. Can you imagine that? Just boiling all your little skins off your little bones? Jesus. Isabel claims the witch taught her a simple charm spell, but after witnessing the horrific scene, I'm sure the girl has been learning the devil's crap for quite some time. So apparently old girl says, oh no, it's no problem, we're just learning some simple charms. And in the background she's been like, hey, hey, hey my pity, you're it on. I've been doing this for a while, we're gonna screw your shit up, and you ain't nothing gonna be nothing you can do about it, yeah. She hangs out, hangs at dawn, her, her would have been would have been husband can witness her legs dangle. Oh, Jesus. I mean, this is supposed to be a daughter. How young is she? And they just already going to hang her? I mean, I know back in the day, I mean, you messed up, you messed up, and that was the end of it. But, Jesus. All right, let's go ahead and check out a little bit more of this in here and see what's going on. All right. Well, all right, how are we going to... Man, I'm already liking the physics of this. Is this going to be... Oh, uh, can we can we move it up? It... Yeah, hey, I got the little board going now. Yeah. Fuck out of here. Oh, I can't throw it, huh? Nope, no throwing. I wish I could throw that, that would be fun. And oh, you just walked, oh, hello. How are you? Ooh, oh, this is our light source. Okay, we got an ominous little candle that has the little thing. Can't do anything with it though, other than pick it up, so here we go. Let's go here. It said it that we're gonna need the candle, so uh, I don't know how important that's gonna be. Is it slowly burning down? Like, is that a thing? Not really. All right, let's set this here. Hey, hold on a minute now before you go and get into the spoops there. I, I, no one said shit about being ready for that. Oh, I said it so perfectly. Look at that. All right, now if I aim this way. Yes, I can read it. Here we go. 
Let me get out of the wall there. That's not where a book belongs. Not phasing in and out of uh, random objects. The book's not possessed by the witches. 18th day of August. The girl is dead. Her tears laughable. Oh my god. Oh, these people are fucked up in the head. Jesus. Tomorrow, once the duke is gone, we will find the witch that apprenticed the young murderer. I must admit, watching her body sway brought me much joy. Okay, y'all are some demented little shits. Like, is this like a scary deal about a witch, or are we trying to look into the minds of some creepy old dudes, like trying to hang people and watch them jingle jangle? That's some jacked up shit. The Baron was soft for the comforts of such things. Family, love, <laughs> that was his undoing in the end, murdered by his own daughter. How pathetic. Oh my gosh, sir. Like, Jesus. He's just a man. He loves his daughter. Like, just give him a break. All right, we got our candle. We're good. Boy, these things don't put off a whole lot of light, do they? I mean, we're only running on one candle power, so we can't really do a whole lot. Like, I mean, is it wearing down? It appears that it is wearing down. I'm not sure, but, I mean, there's candles freaking everywhere, so I don't know exactly what all needs to be done with it. But, whoa, okay, there's a creepy there, so let's go over here. It looks like there maybe there's another book. I don't know. Let's go find out. Come on, little book. What you got for me? What? Well, that's not a book. What is that? Oh, okay. Put this on the... Set it on the freaking tape. Fine, just, just sit there. Oh. Okay, so we just jangle dangle the key on around and this is going to get us into the place. Some kind of key this is. It looks like it'd be pretty easy to lockpick it. Just spin it on. Okay, that didn't work. There it is. Alright, we got the... Do we turn it now? There, does it just... Oh, it just opens. Okay, give me one of them candles. I know I'm going to need it. So go ahead, just give me that. Thank you very much, and let's go on this way and see what happens. All right, here we go. That was a very simple key mechanic. I have to say I'm not upset with... Wait. Can I take the key back? Get the hell out of here. Can I take the key back? No, I cannot take the key back, so there must be another key somewhere that would allow me into this place. What's this? Oh, no, it's just unlocked. All right, well, no key for that, then. Oh, there's another book here. And a skull! A very, very polished white skull. They really must have took the turtle wax to that thing. Jesus. All right, here. Hi, bye, goodbye, Mr. Skull. You're just going to fly on across the room. I really... <laughs> these physics are going to be fun in this. All right, here we go. 19th day of August. Isabel lives. A cobbler brought me the news today. The witch cut her down and several citizens watched her soul enter her body once again. Madness. You did it, dude. You being all creepy and stuff. Why do you think these witches were so mad? Y'all treated them like complete shit. Jesus. The town guard stays behind today to burn the wretch as I follow the hunting party into the woods after the girl. I will see to it myself that Isabel dies and stays dead. Ooh. Oh my. Can I pick up the skull? I can pick up the... Skull? Where'd you go? Uh, okay, never mind. You pick up the skull, the skull disappears. And our uh, little candle here is just gonna spin around and around. All right, there we go. All right, we got a nice dark corridor here. What, what's gonna? Now that's not nice. The last skull, not only did it disappear before I could show it my love, but it sit there and flung itself across the room like a freaking bandit that just ate way too many hot Cheetos. Holy shit. I didn't like that. Nope, nope. Okay, all right, little witch. I'm not the one hunting you. Actually, I am, but it's okay. Oh, my God. A little figure eight pattern there with that shit. Jesus. All right, September. Several days ago. No, no hours, maybe. We could, we could have cor cornered her. The, the letters are weird. I'm sorry. Cornered her in a cave, but something is wrong here. The tunnels seem to run back into themselves. We see shadows of her dancing on the walls. Or dancing the walls. She is dancing the walls. The walls are dancing. She is causing them to dance like a ventriloquist with his little dummy on his little fingers. Yes, that's how it works. Totally. Some of the men hear laughter, others screams. Daniels re Daniels removed his own eyes yesterday with his ration spoon. Not on, not any spoon. The ration spoon. Like I'm assuming those are some really dull, really small little spoons. So that really had to suck. He didn't last the night. I, he just, he, dude, he just cut his eyes out with a spoon. Of course he didn't last the night. Can you imagine that? Trying to live without eyes that you just carved out with a spoon? <sighs> Isabel is going to kill us all. Yeah, she probably is. Sounds like she fucked her up. Like, pretty good. All right, here we go. So I think we're not after the witch now. We're after Isabel, which is also a witch, but not the witch. But anyways, you get... Who is that? There's a cauldron. 
Oh, we're going back to the weirdness days. There's a cauldron over there, so I'm gonna go this. Never mind, we're going to the cauldron. Here we go. There's a, there's a whole light there emulating out of the, the pits of the bowels of God knows what. It actually looks like a giant butt crack spread, so it's like booty light. We got that booty light. It's like Pedialyte, but it doesn't help you in any way, shape, or form. Can I light the candle? No, I cannot. Um, okay. All right. The, I don't like it. I don't. Yeah, I know you see me. I'm carrying a candle. It's not that hard. All right. Well, what's going on in here? Um, shit. Can I grab a skull? Nope. Can't grab a skull. Well, what the? Oh, there's a sleepy bag. There's a sleepy bag. Okay. There's got to be a key over here, cause oh shit, there's the key. I see it. Shut. Oh shit, no. Man, give me that. Thank you very much. I'm just gonna go over here and unlock this door. And that's what I'm gonna do, Isabel. Don't you worry. I'm not looking for you. I'm looking for the way out. Just did it unlock it? Oh shit, I can't see now. Where'd it go? Ah! Aha! I got you now. Uh huh. All right, candle, please. I need that candle back. Yeah, definitely need the candle. I don't think Dark is our friend here, at all. Okay, yeah, yeah. Come with me, little candle, buddy. Little light. We got our little light here. It's gonna keep us nice and safe. <laughs> really wish I had a sprint feature here. Once again, we can go right or we can go left. So we're either gonna have to go left or we're allowed to go right. I don't know which. It looks like it's requiring a key, and since we can't pull the last key, which is identically identical to the first key. Uh, there must be another key. Yep, there we go. Let's go get the key. All right. We're just going to wander through this cave uh, slow as shit. I mean, we do need to conserve energy. I mean, if we ran and ran and ran, eventually we would have not be able to run anymore and we'd be fucked in the bunghole. So, let's go. Ooh. Oh, no. Someone gave her chalk. Oh, why do you, you don't give sidewalk chalk to witches? It's quiet. What's going on here? No, 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 no. Ah! What the fuck is that thing? I know the key's up here, so I have to go here. And that's, mm -mm. Oh no, the, the things are everywhere. Oh, now I got the goosebumps. The goosebumps is on me. Oh, there's the. Oh, I have to go all the way back through here without the fucking light? Oh, shit, balls and a half pound of dick nuggets. Oh, the, we're gonna get killed by dick nuggets. Oh, Jesus. I don't want to get killed by dick nuggets. That sounds like a terrible idea. Alright, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. Ignore the tears. We're gonna be fine. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, we're good. We're good. There's light here. Light is safety. Whenever it's dark, it is not safe. So, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Isn't it? And I'm not going back there. Fuck that. that they can have that candle there. I'll go get my candle. We are venturing through the- Hey, is that the exit? I think we found the end. But why is there no music? What the fuck's going on here? Or is this a cabin? Are we about to be boiled and turned into gingerbread houses? Is that how that story went? I don't remember. I'm pretty sure someone got turned into a gingerbread house. Hmm, I don't like that. Guess what we're not going to do? We're not going to pick up a candle and turn around. All right, we're good. We're good. Just go this way. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. There's no need for this. Yeah. Here we go. Whoa! Whoa! Hold on. Hold on. No! No! Let me, let me go! No! Don't you pull me! I will fight back with every ounce of my. Don't get my bunghole! I am not meant to. Ah! Jesus, mother of McNuggets! Oh shit! I didn't like that. No, oh, she creepy looking too. She needs some proactive. So do I. Jesus. Oh. Oh, that was it? Oh, Jesus, mother of McNuggets. What in the fooky toops? Oh, God. Oh. Like, right in there, it just basically lifts you up and just scares the crap out of you, soils your pants, and it's like, here you go. You're done. Oh. I, I feel violated. That's what I feel. I feel violated. The interworkings of my mind and my, my psyche have been penetrated, and I don't even know where to go from here. But okay. If you like that, please leave a like and uh, subscribe and all that stuff because it would really help. I need new underwear, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and let y'all go. Happy Spooptober, everybody. I got a couple other that are coming up, but I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it was entertaining for you, and I will see you guys in the next one. I hope you have a great October, and don't eat too much candy. Remember to save some on Halloween.
Um, or do whatever you want. I'm just saying, but you might get a tummy ache into this. Not my fault that that happens to you. I warned you. So, y'all have a good one. Take it easy, and I'll see you later. Bye.